Hi guys, welcome to another video by myself, Bates and 87 It is that time of the week again. It is the Foot Champions Challenge. Now, obviously, we have done in the past the full one to watch team with Halo in net. I will not forget that. We won. The next one, a silver team last week. We won that one as well. And to make it a little bit harder, we'll play with a full icon team today. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, we'll play with a full icon team today. The reason being is foot, or oh, not foot, sorry, icon swap one is out, and every single player we're using in this squad today is from the foot swap one. A lot of people have already started claiming their icons, which have chosen Pep Guardiola, I think it's one of them, Crespo, maybe another, um, but we went and bought out and bought all of them. From the top tier to the bottom tier, whether it be Shemichael there or Drogba there, we've got them in the team. We're going to try them out, see what the crack is, and then I've got some future plans um, with full teams in the future. Scare team probably will be next week. Um, a week after that, I might do a full draft one. Who knows? The full draft one I really enjoy, where you draft, do a draft, and then boom, you build that team. And we're hopefully going to be able to do that one as well. Um, so you guys need to channel, make sure you subscribe, leave a like, go and check out all the other champs challenges, as there's been two already, and this will be number three. It is the first game of the weekend league. I'm recording this bit on the Thursday night before we wake up and uh, crack on with foot champions on stream tomorrow. Now, by the time you guys watch this video, we probably will be finishing off our games on today's stream. So guys, pop on in uh, and take a look. So um, we've got Cliver. We're not going to buy him. Closer, Giggs, Sanchez and uh, Butrigano, who I think is a lot of people's, a lot of people are going for that Butrigano, but we're not using him. And obviously Redivaldo. But in the goalkeeper position, guys, we are going to go with the 86 rated goalkeeper, which is Shemichael. I think he was six tokens in total. Um, we're going to offload this team, get rid of it because it's a lot of money. I think it's like 6.6 .6 million coins, this full uh, foot swap um, or icon swap one team. And obviously this idea, guys, was given to me by Chani. If you guys don't know who Chani is, I'll leave a link to his foot channel down below so you guys can check it out. Shout out to Ch Chani for the help. Um, he obviously is like, I don't think anyone else can do this. Uh, so if you want to do it, crack on. And Chani was like, and I was like, yeah, thanks Chani. Much appreciated, dude. And you guys should go and show him some love. In the left back position... We have the 86 rated Roberto Carlos. And these are the specific icons which you guys can unlock. They're not better versions. They're not worse versions. They are the versions which you guys can unlock. And only so, some of them we can buy off the market. In the centre-back position, we've got the 88 rated Nesta. He is the highest rated centre-back which you can get. Um, joined by... Another defender, which is pretty expensive, it is Rio Ferdinand, he's 85 rated. I can't remember how many swap tokens these are, uh, but we have got Ferdinand in there as well. In the right back position, we have got a right midfielder because, and you guys may be able to tell, unfortunately, I cannot get um, Zanetti, Hadji, and I think Michael Owen, and maybe a few more as well, because they are prime icons, and if you guys know how icons work this year, the middle... Uh, and the baby version's only ones out at the moment. The primes are out till December. So we've gone with a Kocha. In the CDM position, we have got Guardiola, who a lot of people already have in their teams. I can't remember specifically how many tokens there are. As a partnership, I would say, if you're looking for choices to go for, Guardiola and Rio Ferdinand are probably the ones I would recommend going for. Um, as that's a good partnership. And I think you can get Carlos and someone else as well. Um, but let me know in the comments below which partnership you're going for. In the centre, middle and left hand side, we've got Balak. Ex Chelsea, um, Leverkusen, and a few other teams as well. German Beast. And then on the right hand side, we have got Steven Gerrard, one of the expensive ones as well from Icon Swap. Um, I paid in the region like nearly 900k for him. Um, and I think the only other expensive one so far was 730 for Ferdinand, 405 for him. And I don't think the majority of these are that expensive. Now they do start getting expensive. In the camp position, we have got the Baby Perlo. Um, decent pace in him, 70 pace, 589k paid. And that's what builds up the midfield. I can't, I can't imagine me struggling with this team, but um, you never know. Yeah, I could hit a pro, I could hit someone very good, um, but hopefully that isn't the case and I can just run through a full icon team. Now in the striker position, the first strike on the left-hand side is going to be the baby Crespo. 85 rated, 536k paid. There he is. He's got decent all-round stats. And he's, uh, he's, he's another one which a lot of people are going for as well. Him, Butrugano. Now if you want to ball out, you want to get a top tier icon from Foot Swap 1. And the best icon you can get from Foot Swap 1, this is probably the man you're going to go for. Didier Drogba. 1.5 million paid for him. And I need to have, don't even want to, do I want to check? I bought him early. Is he less? Is he more? Is he going up? Is he going down? I don't even know. Are we even going to find out? Maybe the server's down. I don't even know. I think the servers are broken. Um, but he's actually gone up a little bit. So 
I'll be able to offload him uh, pretty quickly during the weekend league. So that, guys, in front of you is the team we're playing with today, the full Icon Swap 1 team. Um, uh, obviously, with a Kotra at right back, but these are the players which you could be pick on. We're going to be having to play around with them, not going to be playing with these players. We won't even use any bench players. Um, I'll just put in some random players on the bench. Um, but this team does look pretty good. So, guys, leave a like on the video. Subscribe or not. Let's go and get into our first game of Foot Champions and see how we get on uh, with this. And let me know in the comments below which combination you're going for in your foot swap. Alright, let's get into it and have fun. Right guys, game number one with the Icon team up against... Where they're Burak. I'm sure I played this guy last week. Um, he's got a nice team, a dangerous team. Cheap team in some, some ways as well. But, obviously, we got the icon one, so we're expected to win today. And hopefully we can get a win. Hopefully we can test out some of the decent players as well. There's a lot of them. Um, obviously, Drogba, Perlo, Gerard, Carlos, which a lot of people have gone for. And I've just heard that Skills has actually just, uh, just got him as well. This is a very clunky team, though, isn't it? Look at this. Not really much agility. Perlo I like, though. This guy's not bad. Tough, 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 tough. And I've got a Kotcha. Slow. Oh, this is going to be one of... Remember the first game we did in week one? I think this is going to be one of them games. Nice. Drogba. Ooh, just over. First chance. I, I am still going to stick by... I'm still going to stick by the stance that Drogba definitely isn't worth the 23 tokens you guys are going to be paying. Guardiola getting angry at Guardiola. Inception. I'm definitely going to say that Guardiola, um, not Guardiola, that Drogba definitely isn't worth getting. I think you can definitely get a better alternative in these swaps. This this uh, this one. Who do I have next to uh, Drogba? Crespo, isn't it? Ah, Bates and he passed it back instead of forward. <laughs> I'm giving away the ball. Right, Guardiola, defensive midfielder, giving away the ball there. Right, Crespo. Ball in, Perlo. Right, that's 1-0. That, that, even that felt slow. Nice touch, nice ball. Per Perlo's a player which a lot of people sleep on. He's a, been fantastic in draft every time you use him. This isn't the one... This isn't the fast one, is it? Is the other one fast? That shot looked hella slow, didn't it? I don't know what it is. This is not going to be a good start to foot champions if this player's like this for my main team, you know? 1-0 up, though. We managed to break down his doors. Don't call the FBI. It was just a joke. My God, I thought that was creeping in there. Schmeichel with a good save. Oh, Bateson. Oh, my God. Like, people can't... <laughs> just say people can't really get the ball off him as he gets absolutely shafted there. Right, 1-0. This is not a good first game. I won't lie, guys. Not a first good game at all. It's playing slow. My players aren't connecting. And I can't really test out the players. Um... Crespo feels good at the few times had a bit of flurry on the ball. Perlo's good at finishing and passing. We know that one. But this guy just like slowed the game down really, 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 really a lot. Really, really a lot. Um, and he's just passing the ball around safely. So not the best of games to test the players out. But we stuck with him for another 45 anyway. Nah. Good block. He's not dra if he, that guy drag backs, he's scored a goal there. Ah, oh, come on. He's already off. Oh my days. Oh dude, like could you be even more could you be any more boring? Seriously. This is terrible. I hope this guy gets smacked every game. I honestly, I just hope he gets absolutely pummeled by everybody. That keeper's gonna mess it up. I, I caught. I, look, look at these over the top through balls. Oh, 
Crespo. Ba oh, that's... Mm, I would have given a penalty for that tomorrow. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Go on, JJ. One thing this guy does need to add into his uh, game style, in my opinion, is the drag back. Nah. He needs to, uh, if, he, if this dude adds in his drag back to his gameplay, he'll be smacking me. Oh, no. Good, good, good touch by a toucher. What do you guys think then? So, so Guardiola's playing all right for me. I'm not really noticing a difference. Two standout players for me is Rio and F Rio and Ferd uh, Rio and Ferdinand, Rio and Guardiola. Them two are really, really good. And that is absolutely ridiculous by me. There shouldn't be doing that type of attacking. He's so swear to go now, isn't he? Oh, massive gap there. Good tackle by Nesta. Crespo looks good. Yeah, I think he said I think he could get a better strike than him, I think, which isn't an icon. But Guardiola and Ferdinand, they're definitely the two which I'd go with. And how is that not a foul? He literally went through me like a truck. Gerard's been alright as well. Oh, play on, play on. Crespo's bad in 19. Pep has low stamina. But you're not spinning around with him, though. Oh, could we? Do you reckon? That was not far off, you know. If it was more in the corner, that was a goal. That would have been a, that would have been a really. He's not got his stance though, unless he never had that stance then. That was close. Ooh. Right, a few more chances left for him or me. Ooh, Balak. Ball turn. Dink, off the player. Right, we've won the game, guys. We've won the game. I can't see anything happening here. And we could have made that two then, but we never. But he's got the ball out. We need to win this header, which we haven't done. And now he's through on goal. Oh, my God. Imagine Bateson saying he's won the game. <laughs> and then this happens. Stop. Nice. And there we have. We, we have won the game. And it was not a fun game. I didn't enjoy that one bit. The players... I didn't enjoy the players. I didn't enjoy the players. Um, what I would say, as for the foot icon swap one, the standout players for me in that game were the ones which I think I talked about at the start of the video. Guardiola and Ferdinand. I would say they were the two best people. I think if you guys are going for anything, I wouldn't go anywhere near Drogba. I wouldn't go anywhere near the likes of Gerard either. I think I think he's a waste. Um, but Guardiola, Ferdinand, good combo. Can you get Ferdinand and Roberto Carlos? Perla was alright, but not as a cam. I reckon he'd be a good centre mid. You can't get so you got to get one or the other of you. And then obviously if you're not going to get any of them, go for the new prime icons. Zanetti, Hadji, I reckon is going to be a good one. And uh, Michael Lloyd might be alright. Sherman didn't get to test out Butchergrain. I think he would have suited this team a little bit better. But not bad. Not bad. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like rating. Subscribe if you're not. And there we are, starting 1-0 in the weekend league against Brack. I'm sure I've played this guy before. Very slow player, but we pick up a win. And he loses. Thank God for that.